I'm your host, Chris, and this is the Poop911.com Poopcast. It's not just about removing the dog hair from your car. It's about removing it faster, better, and less frequently. It's time for that vital annual checkup or overdue grooming appointment. Which means it's time for your doggy to excitedly climb into the car and celebrate in the back seat by bouncing from seat to seat while generously shedding hair all over the place. As you watch in subdued horror, you may realize that this is one of those times that your pet waste pickup service is not going to be around to save you. You may start recalling how many times you had to apologize about your dog's hair decorating your car's interior. We are not going to allow you to continue apologizing. We're going to arm you with helpful pointers to undo the damage. Before we jump into treatment, let's cover preventative care. One of the best ways to prevent dog hair from embedding itself into your car is to stop the culprit at the point of entry, a.k.a. brush your dog before you get into the car to minimize the loose hair. Now, we realize this suggestion's effectivity will differ based on breed, But ultimately, stopping the offense before it occurs will save you time and trouble later. Another preventative measure is a specialist-recommended pet seat cover that can function as both protection for the car's upholstery and isolation for most of the loose hairs. Once they've done their job, remove the seat covers and clean them up. Simple as that. Let's get the obvious option out of the way. Handheld or household, Vacuums will smoothly grab the first layer of fur, leaving the stubborn hair behind to be picked up by the rest of our tip list techniques. Of course, your house vacuum comes with handy attachments that make it easier to maneuver around the car's hard-to-reach spots, but a handheld hoover will also do the job. So the vacuum missed a few spots. Using a lint roller or even the ever-so-versatile duct tape, You can gather the most visible hairs, especially the ones that just shed. Keep the roller readily available in the car for quick cleaning moments between or after trips. The vehicle will stay hair-free, and you'll delay the potentially inevitable fur pileup. Remember, this method is best for loose hairs, quick pickup, the easier-to-reach places, and the outfit you skillfully put together today. The lint roller has had enough for the moment, but you still see remnants of your dog's coat everywhere. All you need is gloves. Magnetize the fur using a pair of dry rubber gloves. Static will work its magic as you rub the affected areas and collect as much fur as possible. Place a bag close to you and go to work. If you find the hair is being more stubborn than usual... Spray some water to attain the clumping effect that will allow you to gather more fur as you rub. Combine fabric softener with water in a spray bottle and generously spray the hairy target spots throughout your vehicle. The softener's ingredients loosen up hair stuck in the fabric, making it easier to collect those pesky leftover post-vacuum hairs. A fantastic added bonus of this step The softener's pleasant fragrance will mask that lingering doggy scent and give your car the fresh smell it deserves. Crack the car's windows to air out the vehicle after this method is complete, and you'll have a dry, refreshingly clean car awaiting your return. Don't pull your hair out if there's still hair lingering in certain places after you've attempted the tried-and-true steps we've presented so far. This proven final step should gather the remaining pieces with a wire brush that happens to be perfect for stubborn hair. The brush will remove any last pet fur traces and sift through any excess hair under or on car seats. Sweep it through the hair that may also be embedded in the carpet. Swiftly run the brush along with the car's upholstery as well as any trouble spots until you're satisfied. There! Yet another great tool to keep within reach for future fur removal. Using these tips, go forth confidently with the reassurance that your lint roller is in the glove compartment, the wire brush is stored in the middle console, and your life-saving seat covers are secured into place. Take that next car ride with your doggy, 
knowing that your vacuum and gloves will always be waiting for that necessary hair removal day. Thanks for listening to the latest Poop 911 Poopcast. For more, go to poop911.com, check us out on Facebook, or your favorite podcast provider. As always, your dog's business is our business.